A couple of locals taking to the beach to pass out flyers. They're trying to put a stop to SB 804, known as possession of real property. Second generation Melbourne resident Hunter Kendrick is hoping it's not too late. This bill passes, what that'll do is that'll privatize somebody's land down to the waterline. Tourist Violetta Albright likes coming to the beach with her daughter. She was shocked to find out about the bill. That's horrible because we, we love the beaches like this and walk miles. The bill filed at the beginning of November quickly passed with a 12 to 1 vote at the beginning of this month. If the bill passes, you can start seeing more signs up like this, but instead of saying entering lifeguard protected area, you will start seeing signs saying warning trespassing. Surfer Eric Audette had no idea things on this beach might be changing. Parts of it becoming private, breaking the law to cross. Audette says, unfortunately, it's happening already at other beaches. I lived in Vero Beach for a while, and there were a few beaches like that, and it did. It, it was kind of unfortunate. So what do we have to do to keep this from happening? This is something that could have potentially even passed yesterday. And if not, it could be on the governor's desk over the weekend. But if that's the case, Kendrick says he wants everyone to know and fight to keep the beach open to the public. On Paradise Beach, Crystal Knowles, Spectrum News 13.